so guys this is my birthday vlog um it's my birthday in two minutes and we are currently in the air one minute oh my god my birthday in one minute <laughs> i don't even have a drink shall i get this quickly yeah glass of champagne can i have a glass of champagne of quickly course, yeah. it's our birthday in one minute Oh my god, it's my birthday in literally 30 minute. seconds. We're just What's going on whatever's on our phone. It's a Bangkok time. Bangkok time. Bangkok time. Yeah, Bangkok and time. And before we land, it's Dubai time. It's weird. It's weird. It's weird. It's my birthday. <gasps> Happy birthday! <laughs> Happy birthday to ya. Happy birthday! Happy birthday to ya! Happy birthday! Happy birthday! Happy birthday! Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Girls, we've just learned to be So everyone, it is 1.58 in the morning and as my birthday, I wouldn't even say this is breakfast, we do meals. I basically showed Millie this video I'd of this, this amazing looking pasta. When we got drunk and this is our like drunk food. Yeah. After a night out, we go and eat. That is literally exactly what this is, yeah. Hi guys, so we have just landed at Heathrow. It's now officially my birthday. <laughs> <Okay time. laughs> um, I've literally experienced my birthday already in Bangkok time, in Dubai time, and now in London time. So I've actually experienced three birthdays then. I don't know whether I'll ever do that again. But anyway, I'm going to come off here, then I'm going to get picked up, and then, yeah, then I can probably, I feel like I should take this off, then I can just look at my hair. Not a vibe. Oh, I need my nails done, but anyway, then I can probably experience my birthday because I've got a really busy day today and I'm really excited. So guys, I have just got back from my flight and this lovely girl who messaged me on Instagram, I'll put the out underneath here, is styled event hire and she's done this all for me. It is absolutely beautiful. Mum said she came yesterday and she told me that she had a glass of wine with mum. Did she? Uh, haircut? Yeah, Mum's had a haircut, but Mum, did you have a glass of wine? <laughs> anyway, yeah, so how lovely. Lucinda turns 23. Absolutely obsessed. Birthday girl! You're the birthday girl! Hi guys, so I am now looking a little bit more fresh. I am dressed in Zara, which is actually a vibe. Feeling fresh and clean being 23 um anyway we are off to my favorite f well i was going to say it's my favorite favorite place but to be honest it's not my favorite favorite place because you can never get a table here it's called oof um and it's a really nice like brunchy place however my mum has just made scrambled eggs on toast and i've just eaten that and now i'm not even really that hungry but they actually do like amazing hot chocolates like amazing stuff like that so i'm gonna go there have a little birthday brunch and then my mum dropped off um my heels that i wear all the time these like really nice ysl ones that i've completely mullered on nights out she's dropped them off to a guy in town that said that he can fix them right this is what happens on my high street where i live it's a little high street with like no space and these massive lorries come through and just stops all the traffic but anyway um, my mum actually tried to also drop off my pink Valentino ones, but they are past the point of no return. I've got people coming over later, friends and families, so that'll be fun. But yeah, 
to be honest it's been a bit of a weird birthday because i landed obviously this morning i was ridiculously tired i was very emotionally unstable i was like crying I, do I don't know what was wrong with me i think it was literally because i was so tired that like yeah new channel was not okay but now i'm like sort of okay i might have another coffee to get me through but yeah i am not sleeping today because it's my birthday i can sleep tomorrow oh my god so guys this lighting um, my lovely boyfriend has actually surprised me with a outdoor cinema, um, which I am so, so excited for. So he got the date night experience for two. Guys, there is literally hot water bottles, which are like four foot long. We didn't know what movie to watch. It said we might watch Harry Potter. In um, Thailand, we obviously had a cinema room as well and we chose to watch Twilight. And me and Millie watched, well, the other two girls got too tired, so they went up after the first one, but me and Millie carried on watching the second one. That is actually a really good series, by the way. But anyway, I'm going off on a tangent. But yeah, I think we might watch Harry Potter because it just never gets old. Yeah. The only good thing about Harry Potter is that obviously I haven't watched it in so long and I don't even know whether I've watched all of them in a row that it would be quite fun because I don't know what, what's going to come next. But anyway, I will see you all at oof. Bye! So guys, I have gone for peached from pits, I think they were called. But guys, they actually match what I'm wearing. Like how cute is that? And then I've also gone for a bit of a weird choice for me. Oh, camera. It's like a chilli um, drink with pineapple juice and uh, prosecco. But it's like, it's nice. But I don't know whether I'll order it again because I'm not actually a massive fan of chilies. It might be because I've been hanging around with Millie for so long that like, and she loves spicy food. It's gone for a new, is that spicy pepper? Oh my God. That is spicy. I'm sort of like sort of wearing off me but I don't really like that much hi guys so I have got a well I've basically drunk it now a pals it was a matcha Japanese matcha pals with less ice mango popping pals lychee popping pals and tapioca unreal I do feel like with pals that are a bit hit and miss but this one in town is literally amazing now I've decided I'm really quite jet lag and I'm going to have an hour sleep I don't know why I didn't do that already this morning but here we are so I'm going to go back home have an hour sleep and then I am going to go and have a couple of drinks in my house with all my friends and all my family it's actually not even that much of a big like thing but I completely forgot to tell you guys I planned a full-blown birthday party as in had the venue which you guys would have seen in one of my videos before I went to Thailand oh it was one it was the day after my brother's surprise birthday party that vlog and um I went to go view this place and like it was all going really well and I was really excited and basically about a week ago I got a call from the guy that helped me sort of plan it all and helped me sort it out saying socialite is now completely closed down right obviously I got told this like just before well just before I was going to Thailand. So I was like, oh my God, what am I gonna do? So I just thought, you know what? The thought of having to text every single person and be like, oh, by the way, it's gonna be in this place instead, then have to go see somewhere else and have to plan it all. And it's the day of my landing day and from Thailand. I'm gonna be so jet lagged. It's gonna be too much. And to be honest, it would probably would have taken the fun out of my birthday. The only reason why I was gonna do it at that place was because it was just easy. It wasn't mega expensive either. It was just like, a good place to have it. So anyway, after all this rambling on, basically, I've decided to have a little gathering. Also, heels have been fixed by the cobbler. Mmm! One last thing. It's been my birthday now for 22 hours, technically. Because obviously, it was my birthday this time 24 hours ago in Bangkok. And then I had it again in Dubai. And now, and then I had it again in England so I'm mad I think this will be the longest birthday I will ever ever have in my whole entire life I'm gonna love you all and leave you I'm going back for a nap so I've just got back how insane I literally love them 23 
feeling very, very spoiled. Hello, Brunette. So, my mum has made my hat, well, my house, my mum's house. Really nice. Happy birthday. And I've got this lovely balloon display that I'll be defo getting a picture with. So make sure to check it out on my Insta. Yeah, can't wait for everyone to come. Mum, are you excited? I had a really really fun time at my birthday party last night lovely to see so many people I am actually so happy that I didn't have a mad birthday party that well it was mad but like I didn't have like a crazy thing where like I had an event right let's try this again I think I was actually filming on the way to Tesco and then my thing ran out my memory card ran out of memory so we've just been to Tesco and got so much food that like, guys you have absolutely no idea what we're doing we're doing a charcuterie board i think i'm saying that right so we've got like camembert chutney red onion relish olives like stuffed fe feta dried mango that was a bit random but anyway i've got these like boards i'm going to make it look insane because tonight <laughs> We have a outdoor cinema company coming and I'm honestly so excited. I genuinely can't even believe it. So exciting. I've been surprised. And we've got like the um this package where it's like fluffy popcorn water bottles, cards. we've got a popcorn cart, we've got like a massive water bottle which is like huge just gone to a camera shop quick and got a memory card we were literally on the way back to do it and then i was like oh my god my memory card because obviously i do want to vlog it but anyway we will see you when we see the cinema <laughs> but anyway i'll see you later guys i am a genius camembert honey bread gherkins not for everyone but i like them raspberries figs hummus um ham all the different crackers actually to be honest i could actually put some crackers in this one and also we've got donuts and we've got sweets and they've already set up it's over there i'm going to show you in a minute and guys we've filled up these so i actually like can't cope there is a popcorn machine how unreal a fire pit They've made it so nice in here for us. And we've got like little bean bags each, all the food. We're gonna whack on the film. We're gonna watch Think Like a Man because I've never watched it before and apparently it's really funny. And we wanted to, we were gonna watch Harry Potter, but we feel like something a bit more lighthearted just because we're in that mood. But anyway, yeah, exciting. Guys, we are watching a series of unfortunate events. My favorite. Hi everyone, I hope you're all doing well. So it's actually a couple days after my... This is dangerous. It's actually a couple days after my birthday. Um, it's now the Monday, so my birthday was on the Friday. Um, I had such an amazing time. I have absolutely no idea how much I filmed. Um, I know obviously I filmed a little bit of the outdoor cinema as well, which was so lovely i've had an igloo before during uh covid that was literally just for um dinner so the fact that i had basically the same thing but just with the cinema was so much fun guys it's 8 30 for me this is early this is really early because today well for starters i've literally got five miles in my car but luckily there is petrol station right here so i'm gonna fill up my fuel and then i'm gonna go pick up my mum and then we are off to Boo Avenue to pick out loads of like lounge bits, underwear, that sort of stuff. Because I'm going to Boo Avenue House, which is like a mansion in the middle of nowhere. And I think it's like 10 influencers and we are going and yeah, I'm really, really excited for that. But because obviously it was my birthday and I couldn't choose 
products in time and all that jazz and it was all a bit chaotic they basically said oh after your birthday on the monday why don't you pop in at nine and you can choose whatever you want basically so that's really really exciting so i'm going to go do that today and then obviously i will start a new vlog tomorrow when i do the boo off in your house Come on, oh thank you. And I need to fill up Ad Blue. Like if you guys have a diesel car, then you'll know about Ad Blue. It's literally the most annoying thing, but I think there's some there. But right, anyway, see you guys later. I am stressed out. I've been actually in Church Square for a while, but I got told Blue Avenue opens at nine. She opens at ten. So I've been waiting around. Obviously, I've got like Louise coming, um, who's helping me sort out my like bedroom and my clothes, etc. And then I've also got um, Josh coming, who's also doing my content with me. So hopefully that will sort itself out because I've messaged both of them and I'm like, is it okay if I delay it? But yeah, how annoying. I'm gonna go see if the avenue's now open. It's 10 to, so hopefully there'll be like workers there. No. Look who I'm with, everybody. I've bumped into my mum, joking. I drove us both. I'm gonna see if Boo Avenue's now open. Mum found a nice little gift voucher. So she's gone to net. Oh look, is this the new Pandora? Yeah. Lovely, oh, I thought it was it? over there. Lovely, isn't it? Yeah, it's massive. So everyone, I've been in Boo Avenue for the past hour or so, trying on so many things. They're just packaging up my things for me now. I'm really excited for tomorrow, but they have honestly got such nice things in. Mm. Look at all the lounge bits. This is one of my favourites. It's like a hoodie with these really cute shorts, and then it has like a polar bear hood. Like, how adorable is that? And this was also one of my favourites. It's so me. It's like champagne y, so pretty. Right, there's Oh, amazing. Hi guys, so it's slightly later on the day, I'm with Josh hey. and we are in Chichester, it's taken us long enough to get here, it really did. Um, <laughs> the reasons why we're here is because we're just taking content before hey. Boo Avenue tomorrow. So first stop is Chichester um, Cathedral, Cathedral <laughs> which actually has loads of scaffolding. Oh, this is cute. This is cute. But I've actually never been to Chichester before. Neither's Josh. Oh. So first for everything. But yeah, I can imagine this being stunning without <laughs> the scaffolding. <laughs> we have found a lovely, well, looks like someone's house, but how gorgeous is that? Cute. But I don't know whether we'll be able to get a picture there if it's someone's house, who knows. Standing in front. Like. I guess it's not bad if we stand in front. Hi guys! So, we are now on outfit... Number two. Number two. Oh my god, did you hear that? Yeah. Um, Mate, you're fat. How cute. Oh. Right, so this skirt is from Club Bell and then this top is from... Zara and I'm just obsessed I do need to brush my hair but yeah so that is my birthday vlog all complete and that is also my content day which I filmed a little bit of all complete as well I hope you enjoyed this birthday was so much fun to be honest I didn't actually plan anything well plan a birthday party that got cancelled and then I'm so happy that I actually ended up doing something else, which was so much smaller, but also so much fun. Just having my friends over was so much fun. And I'm really happy I did that. I usually do like, well, last year I did what I got for my birthday, but I don't think I'll be doing it this year just because, I don't know. I love watching them, but I'm not sure whether I'll do one myself. Who knows? Keep an eye out just in case. But there is really exciting future vlogs coming up. And yeah. Thank you all for watching. Make sure to like if you enjoyed watching my 23rd birthday. And make sure to comment down below what you'd like to see. And obviously, make sure to subscribe. Bye, guys.